Kanban customer journey view going for your customers. So it basically just leverages the custom field. So you're going to go to help desk. No, no, no I'm sorry. <laughs> you're going to go to settings. Then you're going to go to custom fields under customer accounts down to status. If you don't have status, just uh, I think you can pick it from just add it with using custom field. Just the, the new one right here. But go down to edit custom field. And then here are a whole bunch of options. And if you want something new, you just click the plus sign and can build it out exactly how you want. I just pulled the emojis from Google. I literally just copied and paste, or I just I just did a Google search for like red X and copy and pasted it. So then once that's done, you go over to your customers and you go to your view and you make sure you go display as Kanban and then you want to select status. And then I like to have just one so I'm not looking at a lot of extraneous information, I'll just see the name of the clients. And um, just for privacy's sake right now, I've got it set. Uh, so you can't see the actual names of the clients, but all the names will just show up in here. And if you want to move someone, let's say someone didn't have a call scheduled and they schedule a call, it's as simple as just clicking and dragging their name over to the new column. So I hope that's helpful. Thanks for watching. Take care.